All right, so here's problem number 31 from chapter 3 in our book, The Night Book. Right, it says, a rifle is aimed horizontally at a target 50 meters away. The bullet hits the target 2 centimeters below the aim point. Part A would like to know what is the bullet's flight time, and Part B would like to know what is the bullet's speed as it left the barrel. Okay, so if we go with what we've got, uh, we know the distance that it's going to fall, right? We know that height, and that height will directly tell us what it is uh, that the time is going to be for it to fall. So that's what we're going to go with. Make sure that, um, you know, they give us the height in centimeters. Make sure you convert that to meters so that everything works out dimensionally. So we'll go with y equals y sub o plus v sub o y t plus one half a g t squared. Now it's launched horizontally, which they tell us, so this whole v sub o y term goes away. If we take the point here where it starts to be the origin, then y sub o is also 0. So we're just left with 0 0.02 is equal to negative 5 t squared. And I get the negative 5 from 1 half of negative 10. So we find that it travels for all of 0 0.063 seconds. Okay. Part B then asks, right, what, what speed did it travel? And I like this one, x equals x sub o plus v sub o x t plus one half a t squared because it gets shot horizontally, right? If it got shot vertically or some other angle, we may, could debate which equation to use, but because it gets shot horizontally, we have to go with this one, right? So we know that it's going to travel total of 50 meters in the x direction and it starts at an origin right we'll call that zero so then we're left with plus v sub o and our t of 0 0.063 seconds so solving for v sub o we find that the bullet gets shot at 790.6 meters per second okay so there you go that is problem number 31 from chapter three.